uh, Dr. Patrick St. Pierre, the tournament doctor, now 13 years running. 13 years now, yes. <laughs> That's impressive. So uh, how's everything going medically so far this tournament? Actually, this year has been very good. So we, we have good weather, as you've been seeing, and so we're not having the heat illnesses that we often have. And people are coming in, and they're pretty healthy. Sometimes in March, as opposed to October that we just did six yeah. months ago, uh, we have different issues going on. And players come in from all over the world, and often they've gotten illnesses from – uh, other places like Acapulco or Monterey or other places that, that they've been, and then they come in and we have to deal with those illnesses. So, so far, everybody's been really pretty healthy, had a few injuries and things that we deal with, but uh, but it's actually been a pretty good year. That is great to hear, Doc. Um, tell us about this partnership between the Eisenhower Medical Center and this tournament that's been going on for more than a decade. Yeah, so Eisenhower has provided uh, medical support not only for our players, but also for the fans that are out here. And this tournament has gotten big enough that we now have a whole separate first aid se section and different doctors and different personnel to take care of all the fans then a whole separate team uh, to take care of the players. Initially, it started out there was only one team taking care of everybody, and that was a little bit more of a hassle. But this has now grown to an event that we really need two different teams. And you were the head of that team. We are here with the tournament doctor, Dr. Patrick St. Pierre. Take us through a day, day in the life of the tournament doctor. What do you do from when you wake up to when you go to bed? Well, actually, I wake up and then I go to work. Okay. So, so usually I'll go see some patients in the morning for a couple of hours or go do a couple of surgeries and then come here. So we have someone on grounds at 10 o'clock so that we can be here for players that start at 11. And we have actually two doctors that are on site for the entire match okay. up until 11 or 12 o'clock on some days in the first week. And that way we can take care of players in the locker room, but also we can go ahead and take care of court calls if uh, someone needs us on court six, seven or eight. So, so these two weeks are your longest hours of the year. Yes. You're, you're doing two jobs. I really should take a, <laughs> take a vacation after these two weeks. And it's not just me. I mean, we have a whole team of doctors that are here, and we have a primary care doctor run by Stephen Steele, and then Dr. Kentaxis, who's our, he's our head of our emergency room. So he's running the emergency room at Eisenhower Medical Center, but also uh, managing all the first aid uh, out here. And then also with our COVID testing. So we provide that you know, for the past two years to test the players, make sure everybody is ready to go and that uh, people have had their vaccinations and everything else. Well, we are grateful to have you and your team here with us 13 years running. Uh, thank you so much for being here, joining us on the BNP Paribas desk. But we'll let you get back to work. I know you got a lot to do. Dr. Patrick St. Pierre, tournament doctor here. And uh, your health is your wealth. This is the man that provides the health. It's always our pleasure to be here. Thanks very much. Uh